Alright, I had a good uh, Cat Father's Day since I'm a cat dad, so didn't do a lot of gaming today, mostly relaxed and hung out with the kitties. But today I'm gonna go ahead and do a little bit of Bloody Palace for tonight's video. I've done most of my other dailies. <clears throat> Play this for a bit. I did not have any luck at getting Virgil, but I did, uh, I did get pretty far in the Bloody Palace, and I maxed out a lot of Dante's stuff, so that's good at least. It actually loads faster on my phone. <laughs> like 40 revives, so shouldn't be an issue. <laughs> no biggie. Just gonna keep giving me these annoying issues, huh? Just these guys. traditional DMC because uh, long range projectile spam enemies can hit you at any time regardless of where they are on the screen or if they've been on the camera at all which can feel unfair at times they definitely have a an obsession with putting like three of those guys in the back and you can't fight anybody else but them <laughs> <laughs> The style change is not working, but it's great. Makes this a lot harder. One reason why I like playing this on the phone. 
Blue Stacks has a crappy ending. Hey. had this uh, just erase my controls completely like twice now. It's really irritating. Sometimes it just decides it doesn't want to work. Boy, guard. Now I can change styles again. Definitely the most obnoxious thing about this game is how many enemies just shoot at you. It's really unfun. I don't know, maybe I just have PTSD. I don't know that guy too. <laughs>
people playing this because I, uh, I finished the bloody, the last bloody boss. It was a weekly reset today. And I only got to the top 11 to 20%. <laughs> so, this game is definitely doing well. I hope that they fix the monetization at some point, but it's doing a lot right. I'm sure things are going fixed at the time. Sometimes they don't like to get in that loop, <laughs> so it could be better to just try to burst them down or just uh, get some guard meter off them. I think these fish are terrible. Just the standard of being an enemy that most of the mechanics don't work on them. Sick off screen projectile. I really hope that's something they'll fix at some point. Come on, baby. Come here. Yeah, he wasn't even on the screen. Completely <laughs> unfair. This is definitely the hardest bloody palace, but some of it's for the wrong reasons. Yeah! <laughs> 
is going to be next. I'm going to be stopping at floor 70. And then I'll probably do the rest of this later today. What's this guy's name? Frank? Frank Hayabusa? This is the only humanoid boss fight in the game.
as you can see, uh, definitely the best boss fight in the game, but not without its fair share of Jay. He has random armor. Uh, the way I've found to defeat it the fastest is to use only hitting moves like this. Once you get him stunned, you can... Definitely doesn't feel as good as you know, a humanoid boss fight in a, an actual traditional DMC game. It gets close, but the random arm definitely does hurt quite a bit. Palace gameplay. When I record this on the phone, the sound doesn't come through for some reason, so to fix that, I'm gonna have to record on Bluestacks, even though Bluestacks is actually worse than my phone in some ways. For one, the, the controls are built in, whereas on here I have to emulate them, and uh, sometimes that has a penchant for just breaking for no reason, so... <laughs> That's how I'm gonna have to do things for now. I've seen some other people mention that their uh, their built-in recording doesn't work either. So uh, I don't know how much I could do about that, but luckily the main nuisance on here is just the controls randomly stop working, and the game still drops frames at random. Oddly enough, even on here, though this should be more powerful than my phone, but uh, mobile emulation or and more. More specifically, uh, Android emulation is still really far behind. They're all still using Android 6. Uh, I noticed that the performance stays better for longer on here, but I definitely have had times where uh, it still tanks on here for no reason. But the load times are faster on the phone than I actually have built-in native controller support on there, so I prefer to play it on there, actually. Even on my my phone with the bad overheating and stuff, it's, it's still playable for a pretty long period of time, it seems like. Some of the problems are the engine and not necessarily my phone, but uh, yeah, right now, main thing going on in this is... They've got a Legendary here, and then Virgil's in... Uh, Virgil's leaving in two days, so... I'm assuming at that time they're going to give us Beowulf? I don't think they're going to go through characters too quickly because unlike another game like this I play, KOF All-Star, they don't have a massive roster of active combatants to really <laughs> go off of, so... I'm not sure what's going to be coming next. I assume it's going to be Beowulf because when I cleared the, blood, the last Bloody Palace, I got this skin for the Beowulf, but you try to equip it and it doesn't work. So, uh, I'm not going to have the funds to try to get it right away, however, uh, I'll try to get it on the first. Maybe I'll get lucky. I'll try to save up until then. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll have more Pinnacle of Combat content in the near future.